just woke up. It is 8 a.m. and we're spending 24 hours in New York. Starting off your morning with Stumptown Coffee is bound to make it a good day, ladies and gentlemen. Calvin Klein invited us to check out their modern cotton bedding lunch and host a little Q&A slash meetup in tandem with Bloomingdale's and we were super stoked to do it because it meant we got to meet you guys. We hung out in a window display and got to ask you guys some questions, see what you guys like doing in New York, which helped us out in the long run because we used a lot of your suggestions to have a full day in New York. Um, but we basically got to stay in bed and work at the same time, which was pretty phenomenal. We took some pictures, did a little gifting. It was a pretty fun time. It was really great because we got to meet you guys. And then we headed on over to the first place on our list that you guys gave us. We are heading on over to the Chelsea Market right now. So this should be fun. I don't always eat dairy, but this grilled cheese was worth it. Will spotted this place called the Donuttery that had mini donuts just waiting to get in my mouth. What is yours look like? Oh, yeah, eat it, eat it, eat it, get it. Yeah. Is it really good? <laughs> we were so excited. He got plain glazed and I got this crazy honey lavender rose flavor. So that's crazy good. Yeah. So now we are headed on over to the Highline Park, which I have never been before, but my parents keep telling me to go. And if uh, Jet and Robin are telling me to do something, I should probably do it. The Highline Park is a walking path created on top of an elevated section of an out of use New York railroad, which is pretty cool because it basically means that humans are letting nature take back parts of the city. I love that. How futuristic of you, New York. Afterwards, Will took me to see some puppies. He made his bed. He now has to lay in it. By the way, these puppies are all rescues from puppy mills. No exploitation out here. And this is Teddy. I love Teddy. Teddy is mine. Okay, we have had a long day in the heat. It is <laughs> such a long day. I feel like we did like our 24 hours relatively right. Um, but now we're going to my favorite place in New York. Last time we got takeaway from here and I'm so excited because I finally get to eat here in person. It's Red Farm. I can't tell you how stoked I am. I can't stop talking about it. So, let's go get some dumplings. So that meal was borderline pornographic. It was so good. Oh, uh, so good. So good, the dumplings, guys. If you ever get a chance to, go to Red Farm. It's so good. But Will and I just got back to the hotel and guess what was waiting for us? A full bottle of champers. But anyways, thank you to Calvin Klein for giving us this opportunity to come out here. And thank you everyone for coming out. Oh yeah, that came out. <laughs> yeah, thank you for coming out and meeting us and bringing things. But overall, we had an awesome time in New York, even though it was short-lived. I hope we showed you enough fun things to get you interested in coming here soon, because it was so much fun being here, even for a little bit. I'm kind of sad to be leaving now. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you like these kind of travel -y videos, and make sure to subscribe, become a Rosebud today, and you can hang out in my garden whenever you want. I'll see you guys later. Bye!